hello guys welcome back to my channel this is hadidi makeovers so if you're new here and you're joining us for the first time please don't forget to join the family and also if you're a returning subscriber welcome back so for today we are going to be tying this ankara turban mixed with raw silk i just placed it from the back of her head and um, it's a 70 30 measurement i'll be bringing the 70 part up what because we want to do a v-shaped um we want the front part to be a v-shaped yelly so starting off you know i always start with raw silk i don't like starting with ankara because to me pleating with ankara doesn't really bring out um my pleats so if you want to tie a clean turban i always tell you this you have to use your raw silk first so the pleating comes out well and makes your turban more elegant so as you can see if you're making a v-shaped uh, ankara you want to make sure one of the the longest part you're bringing out first covers one part of the ear yeah while the other one is behind the ear can you see that if i had covered the boots ears it won't be like um it won't look like it won't give me the v-shaped i wanted it to be so i'm just pleating like five five pleats i pleated the longer hand five pleats i'm now pleating the shorter hand on top of the longer hand so yeah this is just about it and um, i'm going to just bring out the can you see that this is how i pleat my ankara tango today my clothes is not blocking or my hands are not blocking the part of the head tie so i just pin that down and you guys have to be careful when you're bringing when you're pinning your turban because you don't want to hurt your client or your model so i'm going to be bringing the ankara now i'll be folding it in a rectangular shape because the ankara heta is very small so i can easily work with this because if you're tying ankara with rosak you want to make sure one from the boat is small like the heta is not very big so i'm just bringing down this after i folded it in a rectangular shape i folded it to be slimmer so i'll just bring that down from the back of her head and um yeah it's a 50 50 part gilly this one it doesn't really matter the size or the measurement so i'm just going to twist that like one twist i'll just twist it into each other like this and then tuck in oh, oh can you see that my clothes is blocking the part where i tucked in the head tie so i just tucked it in and to make the head tie tie um tight and also make it um firm on her head so it doesn't fall off i'm going to be using a pin to hold that down so even if the twist goes off it's going to still the ankara will still be there so as you can see i'm just going to tuck that in again like the other part of the twist and this other one i'm going to bring it up because i want to use it to make my um my style whatever i'll be deciding later on so as you can see i'm just bringing out the back the remaining part of the rustle up i'll just be um, randomly pinning that down because i don't want it to look rough so anyhow you want to be creative you have to do whatever it is you like you can create ruffles with this so for me now i'm just basically bringing it up and um as you can see at this part of the video i'm just decide thinking of how do i sell this how do i style this then boom i came up with an idea like let me just fan it out can you see it's just a twist basically so can you see i'm just folding that down and um tucking the rest in and then you see how we create magic guys so guys as you can see i'm just tucking that in with my pin and then boom so basically on a normal day tying a turban has to do it you want to make sure the front part and the pleats you're tying is neat 
like the pleats from the front of your turban is neat so anyhow you 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 you, to, you you ended up doing the the upper part of the turban it will still look beautiful so you just have to be creative on your own so thank you guys for watching and um please if you like this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up and um may drop your comments in the comment section and if you want to see how we created this makeup look i'll be linking down i'll be dropping the link down on the description box so you can watch how we created this beautiful peachy nude makeup look so yeah that's just about it for today i love you guys so much i'll see you guys next week don't forget to subscribe like and also comment bye